Hello and welcome to my channel Reveal and Review where today I am going to try for the very first time now I know these aren't new these have been out a while but I have never had them before so I am documenting the first time I try them and I suppose if anybody wants to watch it great if not it'll be about the same as most of my other videos so today I am going to try chocolate frosted flakes from Kellogg's there's a little thumbnail action for you. Enough of that. I shall just open these, give them a smell, give them a try, and then give you my opinion on them. They smell like chocolate. What I'm seeing them look like here, they're interesting looking. They're not just plain chocolate. They're kind of, uh, they've got like some kind of white type thing on them. I mean, I guess that's the frosting like you'd see on the regular Frosted Flakes. Mm. Okay. Well, you know they're going to be good quality because it's Kellogg's. So, just pour a little bit out. There's what the, uh, whoops, got a little bit too excited there. There's what the uh, inside of the bowl looks like. They look kind of like it now that I've got them out here in the light. They look almost like regular Frosted Flakes that have been kind of, dusted in chocolate or something and they're kind of weird kind of a little bit weird looking got the uh, trusty milk here pour a little bit of milk on them take a couple of bites and I will give you my opinion and send you on your way all right chocolate frosted flakes from Kellogg's going in Crunchy, as you can probably hear. Mm -hmm. Opinion forming, maybe one or two more bites, and I'll give you my opinion. I'm having trouble kind of deciding because, well, let me take another bite, couple bites here and I'll explain to you. All right, what are my, what is my opinion on? I'm going to say they don't they look like frosted flakes. I, don't, I guess I was expecting maybe that same type of frosting on them as what's on the frosted flakes. And I'm not really getting any I'm not really getting any frosted flakes on them. They taste like just chocolate. I mean, they're good. There's nothing wrong with them, but they just taste like chocolate. There's no nothing about them, honestly, they taste like Cocoa Pebbles, is what it tastes like to me. There's nothing about these that tells me when I taste them that they're Frosted Flakes. It's just a, a good quality chocolate cereal. It tastes like Cocoa, it tastes like, uh, not Cocoa Puffs, but Cocoa Pebbles. Only, Cocoa Pebbles, I think, are slightly more chocolatey. So I'd say if you're looking for a chocolate cereal for your kids or whatever, just get Cocoa Pebbles. Um, 
Because that, that's pretty much exactly what these taste like. That being said, that's not really a bad thing. Just Cocoa Pebbles, just a little bit less chocolatey to me is what they are. And they are turning the milk chocolatey, I'll give them that. But uh, they're ripping off Cocoa Pebbles from Post. And actually, it's a different company even because Cocoa Pebbles are Post. But uh, that being said, I think I'm going to give these... They're not really as advertised because I expected, like, a frosted chocolate flake and something that would tell me, hey, these are chocolate frosted flakes as opposed to, hey, these are Cocoa Pebbles or any other chocolate cereal. So they missed the mark a little bit for me. I'm going to have to give these... Mm, I'm going to have to give them, I mean, I, it's hard because, like I say, there's nothing wrong with them. They're, they're good. They taste like chocolate. But just as I said, there's nothing to differentiate them from other chocolate cereals. So I'm going to have to give them a 6, 6 out of 10. So uh, that's my review of it. Like I said, a 6 out of 10, and I'm sticking with it. So I hope you liked the uh, video. Make sure and uh, give it a thumbs up, like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. And uh, make sure and stop by my channel. There's lots of other uh, food reviews on there, lots of drink reviews, lots of merchandise unboxings from bands that I like and other YouTubers that I like. Shout out to Review Bra. If uh, you're into YouTube and you're into food videos, you probably know who that is. But anyway, that is pretty much all I have for right now. I'd like to thank you for watching this video, and I will see you in the next one. Everyone have a good night.